really painful, and you can give some athletes some relief. Temporary relief, but relief allowing them to participate. So if I bring her up all the way to here, I've taken out all the stretch, all the motion. So I'm going to bring her up just till I feel the tissue engage. Don't help me. Just right there. Can you feel it? Mm -hmm. So that's the position. You're going to find a neutral foot. When we talk about positioning and finding a neutral foot, right there. That's what we're going to do. Hold it right there. You got it? <coughs> now you're going to hold it here. Okay. So you can see how she's developing calcium. And she's got a valgus stress. You can see that joint. We're going to want to unload the joint. They do that with surgery, and they'll cut the bone, a little wedge, and bring it out here and put it all back together again. It's kind of painful, but then your pain goes away. Of course, if you continue to go on toe point or you continue to wear high heel shoes, um, you know, it'll probably still cause you pain. So relax your foot, position the foot. You're going to be in neutral, not like this, not like this, but in neutral. We're going to spray the foot. We have some adhesive spray, and it's really, 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 really sticky. And there's some even stickier than sticky because your feet sweat, especially in sports, and the tape will just peel off. So that's an important thing to remember is that you're going to spray first so it will stick. But we're not going to make you spray your feet in this class. You just need to know you want to do that if you want the tape to stick. Because your feet would stick to your socks or your shoes for the rest of the day after this class. So relax for me. Hold it in neutral right there. So we'll spray the foot. Now this tape is pretty difficult to tear. It's very strong. It's elastic. It's good tape. And it stretches a little bit. We want a little stretch because when your foot hits the ground, we want a little splay to occur. If it's so rigid and you're running around rigid, it doesn't allow your foot to splay, not very comfortable, doesn't do a very good job. So the next thing we're going to do is the same thing that you do. Exactly. Tell them what you were doing when you were dancing. Oh, I put a spacer between these two toes. To Some kind of wedge, on. right? Yeah. So we're going to make our own little wedge, just like that. And now we've taken the valgus stress off the joint and made it more straight, correct? Right, so that's oh, what we've done. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's not a great fancy spacer. It just holds the position, hold it there for me. So I'm going to take... And it's not too challenging to figure out. And I'm going to bring this back along the lines of the foot. I'm really concerned I could come all the way back here. But I think I can accomplish my goal to hold this place and come right to here and cut the tape. So here she goes, moving around on me. Hold it right there. Well, I won't cut your toe off, at least not today. So I could use on a bigger foot, this is a one inch piece, I could use two inch, but this is what we call non-tear elastic tape, non-tear, so I can't tear it with my hand very easily. So I can use two pieces, just like this. <coughs> now, depending upon the size, and I, and I can take that out and relax your foot, and you can see it holds her in position. Now this wouldn't last very long, so I can either take a piece of tear elastic tape, come around the ends of the tape, and I want to be careful it doesn't rub inside the web space, because if it does, the athlete will be back and be complaining. So if this will tear, and it's elastic, and it's comfortable. This tab in the shoe would be very uncomfortable, probably cause a blister, 
And so you're going to want to just kind of come through here and trim anything that is not smooth. And then she's holding her foot steadily and not moving it around and testing it. I mean, it seems like every athlete has to do that. And then you can just come through here and cover. It's a pretty simple taping. And now she's got a space. That's the bunion taping. It's the easiest taping we have. Everybody break out, get some tape. Try it. This 